Right y'all, today we're going to be going through the tools I personally use to be creative with my craft and what is used to process them into the final outcome before publishing them. So let's start with the two big boys that are a few generations apart, the Canon 450D and the Canon 850D. Why these particular ones? For one, they're both crop sensor based DSLRs, making it easier for me to get close to my subject from a distance if ever I needed to. The lenses I pair them with are the Canon EFS 18-55mm and the 18-200mm with their respective hoods. I also use these kinds of micro lens add-ons that I can screw onto my 18-55mm lens as well as the colored glass filters that has a glass mount to make my shots more interesting if needed. For moving images, I use this gimbal called the Osmo Plus from DJI. This is a very good gimbal because I can just set it up without needing to manually balance all the parameters as I would with a bigger gimbal. It's very portable and it's not all in your face if ever you do go out filming with this gimbal. Then finally, for something I use for quick shots or if I don't have access to my DSLR, I use this handy dandy iPhone 8 Plus which is my current daily driver. What I like about the iPhone 8 Plus is it has similar focal ranges to my 18 to 200 millimeter lens, which I use on my 850D. It is useful in certain situations. For processing all the pictures and videos I've captured, my main go-to machine is the 2015 13-inch MacBook Pro. This is indeed an old machine, but I love this computer because it fits my needs and demands as a creative person. For storage, I use the Western Digital MyBook 12TB hard disk drive, which is also my Time Machine backup disk. That's where I like to back up my machine as well as some archives if needed. For all things sketching, illustrations, and drawing, whatever have you, I use this iPad Air 2019. This is only a year old tablet, but like I said, it fits the need and demand for my field especially when I'm out and about. Alright y'all, that about wraps up for today's video. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, click on the like button and subscribe for more catch-ups. See you in the next one. Roll the outro!